Alrighty, well, morning everybody, and and this is gonna be an impromptu cast here, um, so just I'll I'll explain more here as the uh, cast goes on, uh, but let me um kind of intro this music. I actually wanted to play this. I think this came out about a week ago, but I keep forgetting about it. This is another one from Iron Cthulhu Apocalypse. Uh, it's called Dream Hostel, and it's more dark ambient music. Let me go ahead and rewind it back. Okay, so um again for the most and for the most part, just pretty much lazed around. I ended up um I think I said at the start of my stream yesterday that I was thinking about calling in. Um I went ahead and went through with it. Um Shortly after, I mean, probably on the tail end of my stream, or maybe shortly after it, I started getting a cough again. Just kind of a... <coughs> <coughs> kind of like one of, those, one of those deeper ones. And then on top of that, um, my cell phone showed that there was a, a severe winter warning. And like, ah, oh, no, fuck this. And um, I know uh, yesterday, and I think today, it had already been snowing. Um, there's... I mean, there's probably about on my windowsill. Yeah, my my uh, my bedroom window has this really big knack for collecting snow. I could oftentimes tell how how bad it was snowing just by uh, how much it's piled up on my windowsill. And um, this time around, there's I'd probably say about six inches. There's about a, a six inch snow bank on my windowsill right now. Um, so been snowing. Um, and again, there is a winter weather uh, winter weather warning. I figured, you know, since apparently uh, I'm not completely over my illness, and along with the warning, I figured it just 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 isn't worth it. So ended up calling in. Um, but eventually, that uh that cough went away, and kind of as of about a few hours ago, it transitioned over into fatigue. So, based on this, I'm thinking at some point of my low-grade fever is going to kick in or something, but we'll, we'll see. But anyway, I just figured discretion would be the better part of Valor and just, just call in. Um, otherwise, the, yesterday's stream, though, it actually went pretty good. Um, I went ahead, I went ahead and just, um, I went ahead and did a Killer Instinct stream. Um, I played Gems of War for probably about an hour, hour and a half. Um, just upgraded some of my kingdoms on that game. Yeah, kind of some bad preparation there. But anyway, well, I was only on it for about an hour, hour and a half. Just, like I said, just upgraded some of my kingdoms. Um, got them up. Then after that, broke off. Uh, played some Killer Instinct. Um, but uh, this and this time around, um, a guy named Bear Razor. Uh, apparently, he's played this game before because he was actually uh, he was actually wanting me to play try out a couple other characters. Um, one was or here, here. Let me, you know, I'll go ahead and do. I'll go ahead and do now like I did yesterday. Let me let me just go ahead and pull up the actual game. So it's probably going to be a minute or two. And um, like yesterday, I'm going to have to do a little bit of finagling here with the window. So I suppose I can just go and switch over now. Okay. It should be working. There we go. All right. All right, so let me... I'm gonna have to kill all the. I'm gonna have to minimize all the windows, and then let me. And I have to do this every time I fire the game up. Change the resolution to 1024 by 576. Shrink it. Go ahead and keep it, and then. And then I think what you're seeing now. Yeah, what you're seeing now. 
It's uh, in the upper left corner. So now you should be able to see it in full screen. Okay. So. But yeah, I have to do that every time I boot up the game. Okay, but um, I'll just I'll just go here. But like I did this yesterday too. I just I find it easier to easier to just show you rather than tell you. So, but um, I think I went here. But yeah, he was uh, he was wanting me to play some of these other characters like Arbiter. Arbiter. Um. Never heard of him. Um, I'll just do a random select there because the other guy don't matter. Bowman. Oh, damn. I have faced the flood and silenced truth. I will quell your thunder and dub it. And... But... And, uh, and I guess while I'm here, I probably won't do it with this guy, but, you know, like you can, you can do a, a boot, although, um, he can also throw grenades, but I don't know, I mean, It just says any punch button, so. But anyway, he was up. Uh, he was having me try out this character, and let me go to character select. Wasn't really into him much. He just kind of strikes me as like Predator. And then he up. Uh, he had me try out a guy named Rash. Never heard. I mean, name didn't ring a bell until I actually went over here, and I'm like. I'm like, holy shit, that's a battle toad. <laughs> nice. So, so yeah, so I, again, I'll, I'll rando select. Like I said, it don't, the other guy don't matter, but yeah, they got, they got battle toads in here. So, and then eagle. Oh, Indian guy on Mortal Kombat, Nightwolf. I have returned from the encounter. No, no idea what he said, but yeah, there's wrecking ball, and I think there's a there's a ram. So yeah, there's like there's like a ram attack. I think there's a there's the big bad boot. Yep. But yeah, but but Bear Razor has had me try these other characters too. I'm like, and um, and I guess this guy here, he's actually supposed to be beginner friendly. I think one of his moves. Yeah, you can just like hit punch or kick like repeatedly. Just But yeah. But that's it. But anyway, yeah. So he was showing me that. I mean, well, pretty cool. Then, um. But still went back to my main character, though, Isako. Again, this girl here is the reason I put, is the reason I got into this game. So. And it, once again. Rando select, cause the other guy don't matter. Uh, her alternate costume. And 
spider chick. But, um, I also learned, learned something else, too. I don't know if I can show it here. Yeah. Um. These, uh. I got a combo assist turned on. And, um, I kind of learned. I kind of learned this during the, um. During the tutorial. But, yeah, you really. But yeah, I'm mean, you're just I'm just I'm just mashing one button here. Yeah, but I think her uh, her combo system is kind of janky. So I look. So I kind of. If you look at the meter. I mean, when that um, when that meter, when it gets too full, it causes what's called a blowout, and you. Basically, don't do deadly squat on your uh, combo damage. See, twenty-one percent. Now, if I would have just kept um, Oh, 35% damage, but, uh, yeah, but, um, I was, I was doing this doing, during the tutorial, probably would have been, uh, better to do on Jago, Jago, like, you know, the actual tutorial character, but, Yeah, you have to each combo you have to finish with like a big hitter. So that that was twenty five percent damage. I guess I could probably um quit out of this. Yeah, here it is. Yeah, and I'm, I don't want to be... I'll try not to be too long on this. God, I feel, almost feel like a little kid now. This is what I learned in school today. Yeah. Oh, wrong button. Yeah, I'm not quite getting it, but uh, you kind of get the idea. I'm only really using one button. Yeah, this is this is combo assist. Yeah, 
to me. But you kind of you get the idea. That's kind of how a uh, combo assist works. There was a way to. Yeah, it. I thought there was a way to turn it off. I can't remember where. But yeah, this it, it this game really does. Does work almost like Dragon Ball Fighters. Oh well, yeah, so so uh, chances are um, I might end up doing on. Uh, on today's stream, I might end up doing the same pattern, playing Gems of War for like like an hour, hour and a half or so, and then um, and then going right it, then going right into Killer Instinct again. But again, we'll we'll see come this afternoon. Yeah, I'm I'm, I'm gonna go ahead and turn it up from my end. Yeah, I'm thinking maybe I should have had the uh, in-game music on in Killer Instinct. There's some pretty quiet music this time around. Actually, now that I think about it, that might explain it. Here, fuck it. I'll just turn it up to 100. Like I said, it's it's not going to be like loud metal or anything like that. So, and um, one other big thing that I did, um. I actually went on YouTube and looked up copyright free music. It didn't really surprise me much. Options are very limited. Um, it's it's either lo-fi, vaporwave, um, and there was there was one other. I can't remember what it was, but uh or synth wave. I think that was the other one. But but then um this particular video came up. I I can't remember its name, but I watched part of his video and it it said do not use no copyright music and um I can I and the reason he, the reason why I I can't recall a specific the specifics of it but I think I have had it happen to me at least once is um the the artists that make this no copyright music I guess they're uh they're these struggling struggling artists they're you know trying to get a record deal. They're trying to get popular and all that. But what happens is is for now, it's their music is free to use for now. But once they get popular, once they start you know once they start making that money, then they'll turn around and make all that previous music copyrighted because they'll want to, you know they'll now want a cut of that music now that they're popular and everything. So, and I, like I said, I can't re I can't recall specifics, but. I've had a, there there have been there has been at least a time or two where I've uploaded a video, the music checks out, you know, didn't get copyright claimed. That is until way later on, way later on, like I don't know, like a year later or something. All of a sudden, just out of the blue, one of my videos got copyright claimed. Just, you know, hey, it was fine a year ago, but I guess not now. So I just turn around and end up having to delete it. You know, so I'm, I'm guessing. I'm guessing that's what ha I'm guessing that that was what happened. At that at the time I uploaded that video, the music I had on it was free to use because again, the artist was an obscure one and he's you know trying to make his way in the music industry and all that. So and then sometime later he got popular and I got fuckled. But uh, he also pointed to another website. I'm starting to consider it, although, uh, yeah, I'm still kind of, I'm still kind of iffy on it. It's called Epidemic Sound, but it's kind of a, 
It's sort of kind of a uh, copyright claim insurance. Like the music they got on here is, um, you know, don't mind the license, we got your back. And um, I'm going to have to turn that down a little bit. There we go. But um, 30 day trial, um, I think it was here. I think. But yeah, it's uh if I um if I paid a hundred an annual cost of hundred and forty four dollars, then uh it's twelve dollars a month. So I'm guessing uh if I went month to month it'd be higher. Unlimited downloads. I'll count your own social media channel, so but like I said, I don't, I guess one, you can do a music search. Um, I think I did this earlier. So I typed down dungeon synth and there is none. No dungeon synth on this. Um, I think there is some post rock. Um, yeah, five albums. And these are some generic ass album names. Post rock. Well, that covers a lot of ground. Winning. Okay. Oh, here we are. But, um, also another thing I like to do on these, uh, especially on these cast videos, is, uh, when running them, I like to have the actual album thumbnail, you know, in the background. You know, I like showing that, but, uh, here, let me, yeah, I think I was doing this, uh, earlier, too. Yeah, I, I it, it doesn't even show the actual, the actual album. It's just the artist name, the track name. Or, or wait, 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 wait. Okay, so Okay, so yeah, I, I think what I'm getting at here is you know, getting like the album, you know, the thumbnail and all that and getting like the actual album it, it's kind of messy. Like So I'm I'm assuming this is all this is all the same album, but once again, I I'd kind of like to be able to have the thumbnail. You know, kind of like what I have here. You know, what I'm showing here on this music that I'm playing right now. I want that, but I don't... I don't see a way to do it. But anyway, um, I just, I just saw that. And, and again, um, the guy I'll walk, I mean, this, the guy here, he's, he actually showed me this, or he actually showed, he showed the audience this, excuse me. So, but like I said, it, it seems to be a very hit and miss proposition, but on the other hand too, if I do, if any of these videos do get copyright claimed, I've got a, I've got, you know, I've got an airtight defense now. So, I mean, it, I'm not, I'm complaining, yet not complaining. I mean, on one end, 12 bucks a month is actually a pretty good price to pay to, you know, to just, you know, have a lot of pe have peace of mind, you know, just play whatever you want. But it, again, there's, there's other, um, there's other moving parts that I like to do in these videos. So, but yeah, it was, but yeah, I'll, I'll keep epidemic music in my radar, but for a, for a give a yay or nay. I mean, I don't, again, like, like I was saying, 12 bucks a month is actually a pretty good price to pay for peace of mind, but on the other hand, it's $12 a month that I could, probably could have, probably could have uh, used elsewhere. And then not, not to mention, uh, it's an, I don't, it didn't, I didn't see anything in there about going month to month. 
but uh, you know, paying a hundred forty-four dollar lump sum for one year. Yeah, that's too much of a commitment. So, but like I said, I I now know about it. I might do it. I might not. Like I said, um, research is inconclusive. I guess that's the phrase I'm looking for. So. <clears throat> okay, so... Okay, so, um, I'll just go ahead and call it good here. Um, I've pretty much said all the things that I wanted to say this morning, and like I said, this is kind of an impromptu cast. I just whipped together some stuff. Um, but, I mean, at, you know, for those that don't know, this is normally my work night. But again, I called in, so I'm, this is totally unplanned, so. Anyway, um, I'll, again, once again, I'll just go ahead and kill it here. I'm starting to babble. Otherwise, um, thanks for tuning in and listening to me, everybody. I appreciate that. And um, and hopefully I should be working tomorrow and Friday. I'm hoping so. You know, so, but... So, any, any, anyway, um, based on that, you shouldn't be hearing me from me until Sunday morning. So, but until then, thanks again for coming by, everybody, and see you all next time. Bye for now.